These displaced Iraqis only managed to bring their family members. It was flight by foot to get from the Sinjar area to the Kurdistan region of Iraq. Some walked over 200 kilometers. Sivo, a handicapped father, arrived with his wife and 10 children. His eldest son, Yasir, carried him for six days. All this to escape the attacks on their village. The journey was long and dangerous, but Yasir would not give up. Yasir carried his father to safety and found shelter, but the family desperately needed assistance, assistance that came in a massive operation to ship in 2,500 tons of aid by air, land, and sea, much of it going to those in hard hit to hook governorate. These items will be distributed to the internally displaced people in Duhut. UNHCR uh, so far could cover more than 10,000 families in uh, many, many areas of uh, Duhuk, in Zahu, in Sumel, and in inside Duhuk city. And UNHCR is trying in coming days to cover more people, to reach more people in different areas. Recent assessments indicate there are now more than 850,000 displaced in Iraq's Kurdistan region. Distributions are ongoing to ensure that all those in need are reached. Aid from UNHCR and its partners has been a lifeline, says Sibo. <laughs> Sivo misses his garden in Sinjar, the smell of the grass and the shade under trees where he used to spend time with his children. But for now, he's just glad that all his family survived and no one was left behind. That's why they're still able to smile.